Again, for the viewers, tell them how you came up with that name when you were performing with Hercules and the meaning behind Power and Glory. Well, it was so uh, Hercules was a bad guy at the time and I was a good guy. And back in our day, uh, good guy and bad guy were not allowed to ride together. That was taboo. But because Ray had a, a, a real <laughs> Ray had a track record of always being late, yeah. you know, or even miss a town. So uh, his last big miss of a town, uh, we were in Chicago. Mm -hmm. Well, Ray came into Chicago. The uh, Rosemont Horizon was where we were wrestling. And he went up to the, the agent mm -hmm. and he said, you know, hey, I'd like to get a draw. Back then they give you, you know, some money so you could, you know, continue to stay on the road. You don't have to go to the bank. Mm -hmm. And so he looked down and he said, how much do you want? And he goes, Ray, Ray he goes, Ray, you're not here. Mm -hmm. He goes, you're supposed to be in Madison Square Garden, you know, in New York. And he was wrestling Hogan, main event. Well, that never happened because by time, you know, he'd get to the plane and so on and so forth. Yeah. So what happened was um, Ray and I were in the town and I said, hey, listen, why don't we ride together? I got a car. Just ride with me. No one's going to know. We'll keep it really quiet. And, and which we did. And when the office found out, um, they approached me on it and I said listen here's what how we're doing it mm -hmm. we get up to the building I get out of the car I walk in Ray takes the car around the back and then you know yeah no harm no foul nobody's any of the wiser right. and I said plus he's getting every town on time yeah. you know which is great and they love that so they're like okay okay just make sure no one finds out so that's what we did and then um I came up with power and glory and I had said to him, you know, this is what it's all about. So I said, we have to agree that power and glory is going to go to hospitals and and talk to these kids in need. Yeah. You know, they're sick, they're dying, you know, cancer. Um, and he's he was on board. He says, absolutely. You know, I got I got like, you know, six kids and, you know. So I was like, okay, great. You know, this is really good. I yeah. said, so I'm going to go to the office. I'm going to approach him on it. I'll pitch it to him and then we'll see what happens. Mm -hmm. So that's what I did. Mm -hmm. um, you know, Pat had said to me at the time, you know, I, I guess I, I can guess what the glory is. And I said, I said, yeah, I said, because he's six, three, 275 pounds. Of course right. he's the power. Right. right. And I'm going to be the high flyer. Yeah. And, and then at the, at the end of every match, no matter who, who uh, is beating the guy, I will always come in. He'll always give me the tag. I always get the pin yeah. because that's the glory. Yeah. But what people didn't know other than some that I've told is that power and glory stood for strength in God. Mm -hmm. And that, you know, someone said something to me once I said, no, we're not God. Mm -hmm. Okay. This is what we represent. Right. Right. It's, it's just that. Mm -hmm. And I said to Ray, I said, there's no one that can stop us. Mm -hmm because this is just meant to be. Yeah. We're gonna be power and glory. We're gonna go to these hospitals. We're gonna talk to these kids. We're gonna give them hope and yeah. so on. And that's what we did. Yeah. And it really worked out well, other than the fact that we didn't have control of our wins and losses and you know that part of wrestling life. Right, but what incredible to have created such a team that was so memorable and i'd be remiss if we didn't talk about your action figure paul if you can raise that up the uh the new uh paul roma action figure with roma right there in the power and glory garb uh where can fans go to at least get a backdated order on this because we're sold out right now well they could go to zombie sailor okay uh they are sold out this was the first batch Mm -hmm. uh, I spoke to him. He's definitely going to run another batch. And I believe he's going to actually run a batch where we are a tag team together. Okay. Which is going to So, be you know, I got mine. Yeah. I got mine right. Yeah. I got mine right here. I'm going to get my yeah. tag team one next. <laughs> yeah. Paul's lucky. I tell you what, it brings back so many memories. I got to get my hands on some of those too. The ha very reminiscent <laughs> of the Hasbro figures there. But again, congratulations, Paul, on that. That is Thank you. so nice to be commemorated in that way.